The gram stain is the most important stain in all of microbiology. It's your biggest tool for identifying unknowns. We'll begin with the crystal violet dye. Place this onto your smear prep and let it sit for one minute. Remember the mnemonic, come in and stain, will help you remember the order. Water rinse is next. And just go ahead and rinse the crystal violet off. And we'll be now placing iodine as a mordant. The mordant will help enhance the staining. It's kind of like wearing mascara. It, it enhances that crystal violet dye. This will sit on the stain for one minute. This can then be rinsed in the most artsy step of all of the gram stain, the ethanol step. Rinse just until the runoff is no longer colored and then immediately switch to water. This takes a while to get used to, it's a tricky step. At this point, we're ready to counter stain. The counter stain is safranin. Add that stain on and let it sit for 30 seconds. Those gram-negative cells that lost their stain, their primary stain, will now take on the safranin. Rinse the safranin, and your staining is done. We're now ready to blot the, the stain in bibulous paper. Be careful not to break your slide. Just press gently. Now we, we should be ready to view this, this stain on the microscope. And it should look something like this, not too thick, not too thin.